this is a wild deer and Jesus, she's acting just like my dog. I took a walk with Fairy in the forest, but she was walking me in the forest this time. And for an hour, I was following my friend Deer in the forest. It's an incredible experience when you think about it. Have you ever been here? How can it not bring joy and peace into your life? Oh, Jesus. I was working and then I've heard some the door was open and I heard some hoofs on the floor. What do we have here? What is this? Fairy, what are you doing? <laughs> I rehabilitate uh, raccoons. Just recently I added a little fawn that I helped. With my goal is to always see them going back into the forest as free individuals, as free animals. It's good. It's swept on the day. You see the chaos? You become best buddies. They know you're there for them. I'll take them for walks and they will follow me around the land here. There you go. We often see them as raccoons and us. You know what? It's a raccoon. No, it's it's an individual. They have their own character. They want to live a happy life. They want to be free. They want to live in comfort as much as possible. <gasps> What's up? What are you doing there, Rocky? <laughs> they only here for a few months. It doesn't last forever. So I try to enjoy as much time as I can with them while they are with me. I can't believe how thick his fur has become. You've managed to rest, you eat all day, you play and you sleep. So you're ready to go. You're ready to go, baby. You're free, my lovers. And you have fat on you. You have good stomach, no parasites, no worms. Yes, my love, smell the grass and enjoy. I miss them a little bit. But as they say, those you love, you set free. I always respect what the animal wants and they want to be free. Done.